guys, just another day in lockdown. Here we are back at our little go-to spot, which is, um, as I've said before, it's called Springfield, Springfield Beach. So we're down here just having a little bit of brunch. I'm having a swim, Dan's not having a swim today. And uh, just sitting here relaxing, taking in the pleasure of uh, a beach with zero human beings. Oh, I can see one up there. Uh, there's been another guy here with the drone I was talking to before, a, a Londoner. Yeah, so uh, things haven't changed much here, although we've got it a lot better off than what you guys have it in Australia and some other places. At least uh, we can go out of our house, we can go to the mall, we can go to the beach. Uh, just can't eat in a cafe. A lot of the cafes are just doing takeaways. At the moment, I'm just had brunch and I'm having a mm, iced coffee. So, yeah, that's it for uh, our life at the moment. It's very, very simple and yeah, lockdown, lockdown here, the same as everywhere else. And uh, there's not many people around policing it, although most people. Uh, toe the line, none of the restaurants are selling food in the restaurant, the little restaurant just across the road here on the beach that we got our uh, food from and our coffee and we can uh, eat it here on the beach so yeah and uh, just enjoying ourselves, enjoying the, um, the serenity, the peacefulness of being at a beach without a lot of people, it's uh, really quite nice actually. It's a good way to get out of the house. It's a good way to get rid of the stir crazy. I've had the drone up, playing around with the drone, which works much better now that I've got a proper card. And for all you drone users that are having major dramas with your drones, stopping the recording every few seconds or every 30 seconds or whatever, check your memory cards. I have all the cards I bought online from Lazada I've been right through them with a testing app on my computer and they were all fake. They didn't read or write at the speeds uh, advertised on the actual uh, label, on the actual uh, container they came in. And so in the end, I went and, and it just destroyed a lot of my drone footage, just ruined it completely, you know, because you just got 10 seconds, 5 seconds, blah, blah, blah. And it, uh, so I bought a card directly from Samsung and since I put that card in the drone it's worked perfectly it hasn't stopped recording once and just worked the dream so obviously there's a lot of fake memory cards out there so be careful what you're buying online because uh, most of the time they come from China and you buy them online they're fake they don't read and write at the speeds uh, Advertised, and so therefore they won't work in a drone as soon as they uh, load up and you use all the cash. Well, then they can't keep recording, so it's, your drone just stops recording. And you've got to wait 10 seconds, 15 seconds, 20 seconds to be able to start it again till uh, it actually clears all that cash. Okay, so yeah, that's about it. This is it from uh, Chat Arm at the moment. We're still uh, in lockdown, we don't go out much, we stay at home a lot. I'm watching a lot of YouTube, a lot of old movies, but also uh, getting a lot of information from some other sources about this uh, situation. And uh, uh, it's made me even more determined to uh, keep my opinion and my stand on the whole situation uh, to myself. Uh, I would only question why suddenly is everything that's in any way whatsoever contrary to the current uh, dialogue censored. Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, many other uh, social media sites are banning videos from doctors, from scientists, from everyday people who just might say one wrong word and the algorithms pick it up and it's just censored out of existence. So it's hard to uh, get hold of uh, decent, correct information 
other than that and what you're getting from the mainstream media. So that's my say on it anyway. So I'm not going to get drawn into any arguments or, you know, contradictions or, yeah. The less we say about it, the better, I guess. Uh, yeah. So anyway, this is lockdown here. This is our lockdown, our lockdown morning here, out for brunch. Quiet, solitary beach, hot as, beautiful day. I've noticed off in the distance behind me out this way, uh, I don't think you can see them, but there's uh, three or four naval ships down there, so it means that maybe some of the royal family are at the uh, royal palace down in... Uh, Hui Hin. Haven't been to Hui Hin for a while, but have to go soon. Got a nasty little skin cancer on my melon that I've got to get taken off. It's driving me nuts. Okay, guys, uh, that's it from Springfield Beach, Cha Am, in lockdown. Everybody take care, be safe, be happy, stand up, get up, stand up. Ciao for now. Hi guys, uh, welcome back to the channel. Thailand Dreaming, love letters from retirement. Uh, so it's been a while since I've posted anything. I've had a few things going on. I've posted a couple of shorts and uh, I really hate to stop posting uh, videos on the channel, but I've just had so much going on that uh, I just didn't have the time. Sorry about the noise. I'm uh, sitting here right uh, on the main beach road, uh, just having some brunch. So I thought I'd uh, give you all an update on uh, what's going on. Uh, Thailand now, fairly much open. Uh, supposedly still locked down, but uh, just hang on a second, I'll show you. So you can see, as you can see, there's quite a few people around this weekend. Local tourism from, uh, sorry, I'm just doing my coffee and getting ready for my breakfast when it comes and blah, blah, blah. So, uh, <laughs> yeah. So a few things going on. I'll do an update on the uh, little set I did about, uh, the little series I did about internet dating because uh, that's fallen to pieces and, and that's been one of the things holding me up uh, the last few weeks. Uh, yeah, it just didn't work. I'm not going to say anything bad about her. It just didn't work and uh, I was sort of relieved uh, when it ended because the last month was... Uh, yeah, uh, I don't know how to put it. Let's say less than satisfying. Uh, mentally and emotionally so yeah I had to deal with that I, I mean I'm okay I, I, no problem for me I, I like to be alone I, I like to be with someone if there's love there but unfortunately it just didn't uh, work out for us so that's at an end but I'll, I'll do another video on that and then uh, I had to have some surgery to uh, have a nasty skin cancer taken out of my head some of you would have seen the photos of that I might throw a couple of photos from that into this. That's been, uh, yeah, head wounds, very painful. And they took a big chunk out, so uh, the skin flaps that he stitched up on there were very tight, so could hardly move my head all week. I've been, uh, you know, a week living on codeine, basically, and other medication. Uh, yeah, so, uh, but that's done now. I get the stitches out on Tuesday, and uh, from Tuesday onwards, I'm gonna start working on the channel again. I've got a few things planned. I've got a few really nice trips planned uh, to show you some really beautiful stuff in Thailand because things are opening up again now. And I believe uh, in October, Thailand will be basically opened up again. Uh, you can't control this many people and you can't keep this many people out of work. It's just got to be done. So you know, my breakfast just arrived. Can you get me some sugar, please? Sugar, sugar. Yeah. So um, sorry about that. Just 
just having my brunch. It's busy, it's noisy, but at least it's an update on what's going on. So everything's fine. Uh, the channel's gonna keep going, I haven't given up. I just haven't had the time, the energy, or the inspiration to really do anything. But uh, I've set myself a goal on Monday. Now the shop's back open and working again. Gonna go and do some shopping for the shop on Monday, get some stock. Uh, make some burgers, make some tacos and stuff like that. Tuesday I'll go to Huyin and get the stitches out on my head. And then I think Wednesday or Thursday I'm heading off to uh, a really lovely elephant sanctuary which I'm going to go to and I'll do some video there. So just an update, I've been really busy, I haven't forgotten the channel, I haven't forgotten my subscribers and I do appreciate every person that subscribes more I appreciate comments I love to see people interacting uh, with my videos um, I really want some some feedback from you guys on uh, what do you want me to do what do you want me to video where do you want me to go give me some ideas give me some inspiration and uh, I'll get on it right away if I think it's a good thing if I don't do it doesn't mean I don't think it's a good thing just means that it's, uh, you know, out of out of uh, out of my reach at the moment. Yeah, so some new videos coming this week, and uh, everything's okay. I'm going to eat my brunch now. I might do it a little bit later on again. So, okay, very busy here, very noisy, and I'm hungry. So, ciao for now.